Do you know who Just Pearly Things is? A lot of you that listen to my channel, my content might not know who she is, but Just, Just Pearly Things is this American chick who has moved over to the UK who the black manosphere have let invited her to the barbecue. She came to the barbecue, ate up all the food, grew her channel to over a million, superpassed all the black men that was exalted her and putting her up on a pedal stool to over a million. Some of them are still at 70, 80, 100, 200, and 300, but they helped this Becky to grow her channel to over a million subscribers, has been accused of stealing Kevin Samuel's content, and now has been accused of stealing um, some some other black YouTubers' content. And now, honey, once she has gotten to where she wants to get, just pearly things has given the black manosphere her white cheeks to kiss. And she's, she invade, invited uh, Nick uh, Fuentes to do an interview. And in this interview, she said, oh, slavery wasn't that bad. Oh, they are over-exaggerating slavery. Oh, Black Americans are always late. African descents, uh, over, she's over there in London. So, you know, in the UK, it's mostly Africans, okay? Black Africa. They're always late, but they work harder than Black Americans and stuff like that. And honey, now the Black manosphere is in array because they have made this Becky look that looks like a, a fish, a toad, a frog. They have made her the white king of the Black manosphere. And now she is giving them her air to kiss. Now, here is we why I'm talking about this. I'm talking about this because, you know, I'm in a lot of Facebook groups. And in the Facebook groups now, the black men who don't want to marry us, right? That's red pill. They don't want to marry us. We're too masculine. We're modern women. And now they, instead of marrying modern women, they are going to stay by themselves. But ladies, they're going to you this is why i keep telling y'all stop giving these men access to the kitty cat right they want us the black women youtubers who they did not help to grow our channel to band together and report her to youtube for all the things she's saying now saying about black people now she might get reported because of what she said about the holocaust but with the, the black out like out here but as far as these black men wanting black youtuber women to band together and 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 get rid of her not me not this black girl not this black girl not this black girl with this afro on my top of my head no ma'am i'm not gonna do it i will not i'm not gonna do it uh -uh, not me it's Thursday. It's a sunny day here in the Northeast in New Jersey. You know, I live all the. I live in New Jersey. These black men, they didn't come to New Jersey to, to in, uh, interview me, but they got on the plane and flew all the way to the UK to interview this Becky. Right? Yeah, sunny, sunny and beautiful New Jersey. Be sure to subscribe. Thumbs up. This is a little bit different, but I, I'm. A, I'm. A, don't worry, girl. You know I always tie it in. You know I always tie it in at the end. Okay. I want to thank you for your love and support. Be sure to subscribe thumbs up. Love is Blind is coming up. I really wanted to do it this morning. But I was just dragging this morning. Married at First Sight, I did not watch, but I will watch and catch it up. Put Ready to Love, I'm behind, but I will catch up and put a ring on it. Of course, I already did that video. Be sure to subscribe, thumbs up, share this out. Let me know what you think about this content. And so now the black men in Facebook who are also black YouTubers and black red pill, they don't want us. These are the men who they don't want to marry us. We're too modern women, right? We're not good enough. They make a mess of their lives and then they want us, the modern woman they're not trying to marry, to run in and rescue them and help them get rid of the Becky that they exalted, sorry, that they exalted, 
who 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 use black people and black content creators to build her platform and now she's once she's built her platform for over a million subscribers now she want to switch the content and is showing who she really is who in god's name is gonna say slavery was not that bad who in their right mind especially for black america for americans is gonna say slavery is not blind it wasn't that bad huh who is gonna say it was over exaggerated we over exaggerated what white person think it's okay to say that black americans don't work as hard as black africans or immigrants what white person in their right mind is going to say immigrants work harder than black americans a racist that's who say it that's who say it. that's who she is that's who the black manosphere exalted put her on a pedal stool made her their god stealing other people's content now she he's stolen this man's content and they played the video where she he interviewed her and the questions he was out asking she took those same questions put it on her platform and did not get credit and now they want us to go fight and struggle because she plagiarized a black youtube a black man youtuber i'm not gonna do it because you know what y'all didn't help us huh Y'all black men on YouTube, they, you did not help those of us black content creators to build our platform. Y'all helped this Becky to build our platform, her platform. And now when she's giving you her ass, yeah, now y'all will need us. Oh, now you need us. Now y'all need us when we've, you've made a mess of our lives. And now we need to report to YouTube that she plagiarized a black, another black content creator. You know what, you know what bugs me, y'all? You know what bugs me about black people? Y'all act like y'all don't know. Let me just say black Americans because you know I'm from Jamaica, okay? But I've been here long, you know. Y'all act like y'all don't know. This is what these people do, huh? How many inventions did black people invented and these racist people took their inventions and put their names on i just learned something the other day i couldn't believe it was created by a black man i forgot what it was i think i i shared it to my husband i gotta go in my text and find it but i i was shocked i don't was it the refrigerator no it wasn't the refrigerator it was something else I'm going to find it. I'm going to, maybe I posted it on my Facebook. I, I was, I was, I, I was shot. It was something that has to do with a cell phone. Never knew, but y'all act like y'all don't know. This is what they do. Y'all invite them to the barbecue. You he, he, ha, ha, he, he, ha, ha. And then when they eat up all your food, then, and, and, and leave, then you want you 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 want us the black woman to come and create i'm not, i'm not i will not have any parts of it the only parts i'm going to have of it is i'm going to take her content and i'm going to flip since she's talking about modern black women i do not understand why this white frog looking woman thinks she has a right to talk about black women black people black history i i don't understand I, 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 if somebody could make it, make it make sense to me. And so now the black man, minus fear, want the black woman for us to band together. I'm not banding together with none of y'all because ain't none of y'all helped me to grow my channel. I'm still waiting to get to $20,000, 20,000 subscribers. And y'all help this racist white woman to get to over a million subscribers past all of y'all, past Kevin Samuels. Kevin Samuels may be a little bit higher than her now. But she's almost at two, th two million subscribers. Y'all invited her to the barbecue. Y'all put her on the pedal stool and was bowing down and worshiping her. Y'all didn't help me to grow my channel. I'm still trying to get to 20,000 subscribers. But y'all go get on planes and boats and ships and trains 
and go all the way to the UK to, to, to help this, this woman, and I'm right here in New Jersey. Huh? There's so many black women YouTubers on here that could really use, need black men YouTubers to help us. Y'all that's at 102 and 3 and 500,000 subscribers, but y'all not trying to help us. You're not trying to help the black girl with the afro, with the nappy hair. Huh? There's so many black, black, black YouTubers. Let me just call out a couple of my sisters. Chloe Johnson, y'all ain't helping her. Did y'all call her and say, let me help you to grow your channel? Kimberly Reviews, did y'all call her and say, Kimberly, let me help you grow your channel? Huh? Kamisha's, did y'all help her call her? Cause Kamisha, Kamisha's a TV star. She was on TV. She's probably going to get a Grammy, an Emmy, or an Oscar. Y'all didn't call her to help her channel. Actually, Aubrey, did y'all call her help her? Y'all, all these, y'all black men that have all these subscribers. Actually, Aubrey trying to find a husband for her daughter. And y'all not trying to help her to find her a husband. Chloe Johnson's been married for a long time. If anybody has anything to say about marriage, it should be Chloe Johnson. <clears throat> huh? Kamisha Reviews is on TV. Y'all didn't try to help her. Kimberly Reviews travel all over the world. Y'all not trying to help her to grow her channel. Me, I have over 20 books published. All of these books up here published talking about marriage and dating. Y'all not trying to help me to grow my channel. But now when the Becky has, 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 has given you all her cheeks to kiss, now y'all want us, the black woman that y'all didn't help to grow our channel to band together to report her to you too. Not me, I will not press not one button. The only thing I'm going to do is I'm gonna use her content and twist it around since she got so much to say about modern black woman. I don't know who gives her authority on modern black woman. Oh, I know, it's y'all black men, red pill, who's always talking bad about us, calling us modern woman. We can't submit. Y'all niggas can't even pay a mortgage. Huh? Y'all need help to pay mortgage, but y'all want us to submit to you. Excuse you? You can't even put a roof over our head and food on our table, but y'all want us to submit and respect and honor. It's y'all ha y'all have this thing where because you have a D, y'all think we're supposed to submit and respect and honor. No, sir, you cannot play your role as a husband. So if you can't play your role as a husband, please tell me why you want women to submit to you and, and respect you and honor you. you just, I need to understand. I, I'm teaching marriage and encouraging marriage and, and let's get married, girls, and don't stop having babies out of wedlock, ladies. Let's choose good husband. Y'all didn't come over here to try to try to grow my channel. You or y'all didn't play none of my videos on y'all channel, but y'all play her videos on y'all channel because she's tearing down black women. Huh? And now y'all want black women to band together to help her. I don't think so. I don't think so. No, I can check with Kamisha's, uh, actually Aubrey, Chloe, and Kimberly to see if y'all help her. But I don't think, I don't think so. I don't think y'all have helped none of us to help us grow your channel. So now y'all want us to band together to help y'all to get rid of this Becky. I don't think so. Go ahead and worship your Becky girl. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. And to Miss Pearly things, this I'm going to say this to you because I'm going to be using some of your content too. Since you think slavery was not that bad, huh? since you think we over-exaggerate slavery, I want you to try it for a year. Try being a slave for a year, Miss Pearly things. I want these, 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 evil men to come to your home, kidnap you from your family, put you in chains, rip your clothes off, throw you in a hole, let you poop and piss on yourself, hardly give you anything to eat. Let them grape you, grape you, sail you across the Atlantic and bring you to this strange world where you don't know, you don't recognize them, you can't speak their language. Let them take away your identity and your culture and change your name. 
Let them grape you until you get pregnant. Have you in the fields working night from sun up to sundown. Let you have the baby. The reason why I want you to try it for a year is because it takes 10 months to make a baby. And when you have the baby, Miss Pearly thinks, there ain't going to be no nice white hospital room with doctors. No, no, no. You going to pop this baby out in the fields. And when you pop the baby out, the slave master is going to come and take your baby and sell your child. Take it away. Because, you know, baby's just like a, you know, it's like a dirty sanitary napkin. You just take it and throw it away. Like there's, it's it's just a dirty sanitary napkin. I want you, Miss Pearlie thinks that slavery is not that bad. And we over-exaggerate slavery. I want you, ma'am, to try it for a year and come back and let us know how it, how it was. I want to know. Because, see, I'm from Jamaica. <laughs> and according to Professor Gunther, my African-American studies books are all over here. You might need to buy one and, and read it. He said, the most rebellious slaves were sent to Jamaica, right? I am a descendant of slaves from Jamaica. And so because we were the most rebellious slaves, you, you the, the treatment was even worse than what other slaves were again. But I want you, Miss Pearly Things, I want you to try slavery for a year <clears throat> and come back and tell us how easy it was. Because these, these Beckys, y'all thick. Because you get a taste of the mighty Mandingo. Yes, Bubu. I know your men don't have, you. they don't have what the African men, especially you, you over there in England, and you have the real Africans over there with the mighty Mandingos. I know you ain't never had nothing from that, which was Brad from Brad, and you got a little taste of the mighty Mandingo, and all of a sudden you think you, you are a professor of black people? Black history, African American history. You are an expert on black people now because you you got a taste of the mighty Mandingo, girl. But you know what, y'all black men. Y'all check out Brother Jason Black, the business channel, okay? Check Brother Jason Black out. Now, I'm not talking about Brother Jason Black. I'm just saying, I remember I watched his video. I want y'all to check him out because he has the whole, the whole interview and in, in, uh, on there and he really broke it down. Uh, so I'm not talking about Brother Jason Black. I'm talking about the other men in the Black manosphere who hate women. Y'all. Y'all are the ones that prop this racist woman up because y'all hate black women. Y'all hate us. Y'all hate us so much that y'all allow this racist woman to come in here, talk about black women, make her an authority on black women and black issues. Baby, that is your dragon to slay. And I don't want to have no parts of it. The only thing I'm going to do is go on over her, excuse me, to her channel. I'm going to take her content and I'm going to flip it around. Because since y'all have so much to say about modern black women, I got a lot to say about modern black men who, who always want to go 50-50. How you make black men in the United States, the United States, your average income is 45, what is it, $42,000 a year? But y'all want somebody to submit to you? Baby, I was making 50000 in my 20s and I am 45 years old. But y'all are so mad at us and y'all want us to submit. Sir, you can't even pay the mortgage. My daddy said the least a man can do is put a roof over my head and food on my table. You can't even pay the whole mortgage by yourself, but y'all want somebody to submit to your respect, your honor, you. Boy, bye. Mama. Yes, ma'am. Do 
I think we don't have to do the other two links that we did because I'm on another level. Oh, you don't want to do the other tutoring that you have to do. Come here. Yeah, because okay. I'm okay. on another level. Okay, that's fine. No. Yes. No. I want to tell them. No. I want to tell them that I am raising my black son. Come here. No. no. I am raising my husband and I are raising our black son to do what, Michael? To do tutoring. Not to do tutoring. You gonna who you you gonna tell me your plan for your life? You're gonna finish your school. Don't say your school name. You're gonna finish your school. Go to another school. Then you're gonna go to college. Say it out loud. Come, come over here. Mm -mm. You're going to get a good job. You're going to buy a house. You go buy a house. Oh, yes, I did say daddy and I. We're gonna buy help you to buy your first house. And then what's what's the next thing you're gonna do? Say it loud. Say it loud. No. You better do say it loud. You gonna find say it. Okay, okay. All right. Go, go, go. We're getting ready to go. Did you make your snack? Yeah. He's gonna find him a black woman that he's gonna love, he's gonna provide for. <laughs> And he's going to protect. And he's going to have beautiful black children. Okay, right? Go make a snack. Go make a snack. Oh, you did already. I'm raising my black son to find a black woman and marry her. Don't you, don't, I tell him, don't you bring nobody else. She's not black. She look like mommy or Lexi with mommy and Lexi here. And y'all the same men Talk about passport bros going overseas, get these women as if they don't want to come here, as if they're not going to act and do what they need to do to come. Y'all so stupid. Y'all so stupid. I got to go. I love you. Talk to y'all later. Let me know what you think. Talk to you later. Be sure to subscribe, thumbs up, share this out. Bye.